Yeah. Yeah. Are just sort of features at this point. Sure. Um, not playing a full game. So I'm holding in my hand a controller that would be on the front door if people came in and out. And that controls the pacing of the game, like the slides moving by. So this is, you know, people coming through. Um, then there's sensors out there, which I think is before I turned on, that move the ship up and down. And then there's collision detection. <laughs> so all this is running on tones with me. Uh, so while you're moving down, it's classic video game, you're immune to anything. But once you hear the music, you can take damage again. So we've crashed once. We have on this giant ship. Um, some sort of giant robot that I can't avoid hitting. <laughs> so we've crashed twice. game is called R-Type, and I'm calling this lighter R-Type. Um, it's interesting because in the history of video games, it was about memorizing the path through the game more so than like having the most firepower or skills, which I've sort of kept going in this, so you sort of have to know which way to go or you'll get stuck. Um, It crashed for the third time. <laughs> Game's over. <laughs> so just so it's clear, his the code is is now resetting all the slide projectors. So, <laughs> yeah. so you're not pushing the buttons, you're just like no. his hands are on his head. <laughs> um, and it knows when it gets the slide one, which got to. And then it waits a few seconds. And then takes the ship back to the beginning position. 